Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Dirana Binti Dashfai. My metric number 197000. Okay, so this is my project, uh, final year project uh, for 2022. So the title of my project is Effects of Sandwich Combination Material on Fields Deposition Modeling 3D Printed Specimen. So I'll explain for the abstract. So here the abstract uh, already include all the elements from the thesis, from my thesis. So this is the abstract. So FDM is widely used to produce desired 3D printing, like 3D object due to low cost and less setup time spans compared to other 3D printing methods. However, limited research was reported to the potential of utilizing the research of multi-material additive uh, manufacturing machines, MMAM, on FDM. The combination of these multi-materials should uh, result in a better mechanical properties compared to using only one type of material because um, they combine like two material, two type material. Okay, so the objective of this study are to determine the optimal material for constructing a combination of two different materials using FDM and also to analyze the mechanical strength of the fabricate specimens. Uh, this is using tensile test. So the, uh, the research uh, is based on experimental work so there are uh, there are nine types of specimens were needed and the specimen were printed in sandwich form six out of nine specimens are used to achieve the objective that i just mentioned uh, before and uh, the another three specimens are used for the reference uh, which is uh, it's like the reference specimen to compare uh, with the six specimens so to print the specimens important parameters were needed such as temperature temperature infill speed infill density and fill pattern types so from this research it was found that sandwich combination of ABA and PLA, PLA provide highest tensile strength uh, highest tensile strength therefore the recommendation is the useful product achieved by this project we are aware PLA is more beneficial than ABS so in conclusion the optimum temperature of the three types of specimens are uh, for ABS is 250 uh, degrees Celsius, PLA 205 degrees Celsius, and wood is 200 degrees Celsius. The highest tensile strength, uh, the value of the highest tensile strength is 31.3 MPA, which is uh, the sandwich formation of PLA and ABS, which is the PLA in the middle. Meanwhile, the low tensile strength is 21.62 MPA, which is uh, the combination of wood and ABS, where the ABS in the middle. It's also found that the reference specimen of PLA have low value of strain that make PLA a dominant value when it combined to other natural. Therefore, the value of uh, strain, uh, strain for other types of specimens are quite similar with PLA. So I'll move on to the objective. So actually the objective I already mentioned from the abstract, which is to determine the optimal parameter. So there's a few parameter, which is the temperature, uh, most important, and um, the infill, infill, which is just about three types, infill speed, infill density, and the pattern. So uh, the second objective is to analyze the strength, which is, uh, this one is using tensile test. So we can get the um, stress and strain for each type. Okay, so move on to the methodology. Okay, so this one, the methodology, so as you can see here, the first one, start, and then uh, identify the problem statement uh, from this project, and then develop the 3D model using SOLIDWORKS. Um, and then machine setup, which is the parameter that I just mentioned, uh, and then the parameter optimization. So in this uh, parameter optimization dimension, uh, there are about three types, uh, three methods, which is a recommendation, uh, which is recommendation from uh, literature review, and suggestion. Suggestion is from um, the someone, like uh, for me, from assistant lab. And the last one is simulation. Maybe it's from software. And this, this machine setup and parameter optimization is of the different. And then we move on to print the 3D specimen after we set up the machine parameter. So if it's yes, don't, uh, then we can print the 3D specimen. If no, we have to, I have to set up again. And then move on to tensile test. And the last one is comparison with, uh, comparison with reference results and refer literature review. So this is the objective. So end the process. 
Uh, okay, so move on to result and discussion. Okay, this is the result and discussion, which is uh, I already um, collect it and make in table form. So this is, you can see uh, that one, that two, that three, and that nine. So we can see here, type seven and nine is the reference. So uh, the left right of um, uh, the first column, uh, I also include the picture of the specimen, the layer of the specimens. The, of the arrangement of the specimen. So we can see clearly uh, from the result. So we can see this is the result. And we can see here uh, is overall uh, one to nine. The highest tensile stress is type seven, which is 34.75. But if we only uh, analyze type one anti type six, uh, the highest uh, tensile stress will be 31.3, which is type two. And the lowest is 21.62 or 6. Uh, that's 6. Okay, so we move on to the graph. So this is the graph. Um, so you can see here type 1, the blue color, type 2, the, the light blue color. So I already um, justify in based on the color and you can see clearly how it break, how it's um, different with each other. With, uh, one another. So you can see here the lowest one is type 9, which is wood. It's spread uh, earlier than the others. Okay, so move on to the next figure is the final result of, or, or the final image of the specimens. So you can see here uh, type 1, type 2, type 3, type 4, and then type 9. So if you see here, um, type 2C, uh, there's like, um, not, uh, it's not break beautifully. <laughs> like, it's like um, the layer between the material break first and then uh, they fail um, from all the material. It's also can see from the 5C, like part C, you can see here. Okay, so uh, as for the as for the conclusion, it was on the optimal temperature of three types of specimens: uh, ABS, PLA, and wood. Uh, ABS is two hundred fifty, PLA two hundred five, and wood two hundred. Also, the heated bit temperature for all three types is sixty five degrees Celsius. Uh, is like the fixed um, temperature. Other fixed parameter is a uh, layer height, uh, layer height is 0 0.15 mm, infill density is 100%, infill speed is uh, 60 mm per second, and infill pattern type is quick. So, there's also another um, parameter that I also include in the in my thesis, uh, in, in my thesis. And the next conclusion is the highest tensile strength of sandwich combination is 31.30 MBA. Uh, which is ABA and BLA, ABS and BLA, uh, type 2. Uh, the lowest tensile strength is 21.62, which is Woods and ABS, which is type 6. So the sustainable development goals um, is uh, for this project is post, uh, the suitable SDG is goal 9, which is industry, innovation and infrastructure. So the benefit of 3D printing uh, is it can improve the share of G G D SDG that is de derived from an industry by allowing more economies access to the tools necessary to manufacture complex products. It also increase, uh, increases access for small scale products uh, for producer by making the capital cost of manufacturing complex products lower. But the more it boosts innovation heavily, more intricate designs and encouraging innovation in the materials used to create their product. So I think that's all for my poster. Thank you.